Welcome to Yoga Health and Wellness with Leanne. Just come to a seated position, however you choose. Sit comfortably, close down the eyes, place the hands onto the knees or at your heart center. Relax the shoulders and slowly become aware of your breath. Take a long, deep inhalation in through the nose and open the mouth and breathe it out fully. Relax the shoulders, relax the breath. Imagine breathing into the left side of the nose and exhaling breath out through the right. Breathing in through the right side of the nose and breathing out through the left. Relax the breath, relax the shoulders. And then come to all fours onto the mat. Hands underneath the shoulders, fingers spread nice and wide. Look around at the back of the feet, make sure that they're in hip width distance apart. And then lower the belly, curl the tailbone and gently look up with an inhalation. And then exhale round the spine, arching the back up, arching up, arching up like the cat. And now lower the belly again, curl the tailbone, look up slightly back into the cow pose. We're flexing and extending the spine. And then arch up again, lower the head, send all breath out. And then inhale, come up into a nice long spine. And then curl the toes and press the hips up into downward facing dog. You can have the knees bent if you like. You can step the heels out, heel toe, heel toe, and shake the hips from side to side. And then press the heels as close as you can to the mat and relax the shoulders, relax the head. We're creating an inverted V and lengthening the spine. Just breathe in for long, deep inhalations and exhale out long and deep with an open mouth. And then lower yourself to the earth, placing the knees down onto the mat. Toes are touching, knees can be as wide or wider than the mat. Pray, bring the hands out in front of you and lower the forehead into child's pose. Relax and breathe. This is a resting pose. Enjoy. Then slowly raise the shoulders up and the feet up behind you. The arms are out towards the side, just like you're flying. A nice soft gaze down at the earth. Relax and breathe. And then come back into your resting pose, child's pose, toes touching, knees as wide as the mat, arms out in front of you and lower the forehead. Breathe into the pose, inhalations in, exhalations out, relax the shoulders. Then come and lie down onto your back. Bring the knees into your chest and roll around clockwise and anti-clockwise with the legs. Hug the knees into the chest and relax and breathe. And then drop the feet towards the mat, bring them hip width distance apart and press the hips up, pelvis up nice and high. Pretend like you have a block between the knees, or if you have a block, put it between the knees, squeezing into the block. Clasp the hands underneath the body, pressing the pinky fingers into the mat, and relax the shoulders, relax the neck, and breathe in for three to four, breathe out for five to six. Then one vertebrae at a time, lower the body all the way back down towards the mat, Bring the knees back up into the chest to roll around clockwise, anti-clockwise, giving the lumbar spine a nice little massage. 
and then press the feet back down towards the earth and press the hips up, pelvis up nice and high for another bridge pose. Squeezing the knees in towards each other or a block between the knees. Relax and breathe. And slowly release the spine all the way along the mat again and swing the legs up towards the sky, holding on to the sides of the feet, bending the knees towards the chest to reach the feet and just pressing slightly with the hands into the feet and the knees are tracking towards the chest. The whole spine is released along the mat, a nice long spine. This is called happy baby pose. You can swing the hips from side to side as well as you, if you like. And then slowly allow the knees to fall over towards the right. Reach the left hand out towards the left. And the right arm just rests onto the knees. And your gaze is just slightly over the left shoulder. This is called supine twist. Relax and breathe. And then gently swing the legs over towards the other side, towards the left, and allow the right arm to come out. Shoulder height and up a little bit if that's comfortable for the shoulder. Rest the left hand onto the knees and just gaze over the right shoulder. Taking some long inhalations in for a count of three and breathe all breath out for a count of five. Squeezing those organs together, helping our digestion. And then move the legs back up into happy baby pose, holding on to the sides of the feet. Moving the knees, tracking them towards the armpits, relax and breathe. The whole spine is along the mat, tailbone pressing into the mat. Inhale in for three to four, breathe all breath out for five to six. And then slowly release the legs towards the earth. Allow the feet to flop open towards the sides. The arms are out, the palms are up. Close down the eyes. Allow the breath to return to normal. Allow the feet, the toes to be relaxed. The lower legs relaxed. The knees, the upper legs relaxed. The pelvis, the hips relaxed. The lower back relaxed. The belly relaxed, the chest relaxed, the upper back relaxed. Relax the shoulders, relax the arms, lower, upper, elbows. The hands are heavy, the fingers relaxed. The neck is relaxed, the jaw is relaxed. The facial muscles relaxed. The forehead is relaxed. Ears, eyes. Temple relaxed. Eyes are soft. The belly rises and falls naturally with every inhalation and exhalation. Enjoy these few moments. This is your time. Try not to think about your day or plan your day. Allow the thoughts to float by like clouds in the sky, engaging them, not letting them float on by. Sink a little deeper into the mat. Relax. Allow 
your body to roll over onto the right side and just stay there for a moment in the fetal position. And then slowly placing the hand, right hand down onto the earth and push yourself back up to a seated position, sitting comfortably any way you choose where we began the practice today. So hands on the knees or at your heart center. Still keep the eyes soft. We'll finish today with three level breaths. I'll just step you through it first. With three level breath, we're going to take three small sips of air to the lower belly and hold for three. Three small sips of air to the lower ribs and hold for three. Three small sips of air to the upper chest, heart, lungs and hold all breath for a count of eight and then breathe all breath out. So relax the breath. Take a long deep inhalation in through the nose and breathe all breath out fully. A little more. Then take three small sips of air like sipping through a straw to the lower belly. Hold for three. <laughs> Three small sips of air to the lower ribs, hold for three. <laughs> three small sips of air to the upper chest, heart, lungs, <laughs> hold all for a count of eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Breathe all breath out. Relax the shoulders. Finish with gratitude for something or someone in your life or something in nature that blew you away. Send some gratitude, bringing the hands together in prayer and raising them up between the brow at the third eye for right thoughts and bringing them back to the heart center and bowing. Namaste. Thank you for allowing me to guide you through your practice today. Have a beautiful day or evening.